How is everybody doing today? My name is Master Zero, and welcome back to another reaction video. This time we're reacting to Worms, Nuts, and Killer Shrimps, Allergies Explained by In A Nutshell. Alright, so I'm really excited to get back into In A Nutshell's videos, even though it seems like I've literally just reacted to the previous one, you know? But keep them coming, I say, man. It's just so filled with, like, just, long story short, just information, man. It's, like, so information heavy. And, like, the whole pondering and stuff that, like, science tags along with, you know? It's just, it gets me every single time. And this is no exception, because, like, I don't think I'm allergic to any type of, like, food as far as they were talking about, you know? But even the worms, I don't think anybody eats worms. But it could be a delicacy. But, like, I, my, I am allergic to something or most things that sting or bite me you know and being from south texas that's kind of deadly so like i know for sure i'm allergic to like wasps and bees because i swell up like crazy but like even a mosquito dude my whole freaking arm swells up if just one bites me so i think i'm allergic to them too but i didn't go to the doctor for that you know so i'm just very excited for them to explain what allergies are and like what happens to your body and stuff and i'm sure the immune system has something to do with it as well maybe it doesn't do the job properly or like well enough as it should you know to like try to thwart whatever's happening or it could make make it be like i don't know like they think it's a threat like even though it kind of is a threat so i'm very excited to get this going so without any further ado here's worms nuts and killer shrimps allergies explained if you're a fan of our work i am probably value rigor and humility in i i do oh an advertisement to change your mind that's usually at the end new information you might also appreciate the I same am a fan of doing that applied to important questions like how can my donation make the biggest impact oh give well this video sponsor hey. does precisely that they another banger advertisement man or sponsor whatever you want to call mistakes it for free More let's details, go including how to get your donation matched at the end of this video love that more knowledge. An <laughs> Whoa, Beetlejuice. Like finding a spider in oh your bedroom God. and exploding a nuclear bomb. Jesus sure, freaking Christ! Spiders are upsetting and now dead, but so are They're all your, of your neighbors and your dog. You can be <laughs> That's true. To incredibly diverse and weird amount of stuff. Pollen, dust, insects, oh stings, God. animal hair, insect kind stings, of food, <laughs> latex, and even your own sweat. What are the really? things I did not know people are allergic to sweat. They that must be terrible. Out suddenly and violently. Oh and my god. You can develop new allergies. One moment you're enjoying a shellfish you ate thousands of times before, and the next moment oh, you no. wake up in an ambulance. A shrimp can kill you. I honestly didn't How know bizarre. you could gain allergies. But like, what are allergies? Why do our that's bodies my flip question. the table on harmless stuff? I have a cousin There's that's a allergic to peanuts, like deathly allergic. To share with you. Humans Let might me have hear created it. allergies by accident by getting rid of worms. Huh. This is very that's where the worms come in. For your ancestors, interesting, yeah. being infected hey. by worms was a real magic the gathering. We won't get into the disgusting details, but in a Why world not? where <laughs> drinking water and our poo were close buddies, some oh. species of worms found just the perfect cycle of life. They enter your okay. bodies with the water. And so we're talking like prehistoric, not prehistoric, Sometimes medieval times. And then release their eggs or larvae with your poo, which ah. used to go back to the water we drank. But you weren't going to get into so, the disgusting until details. Recently, in evolutionary terms, our ancestors had to deal with so, frequent or in a way we got too cleaned. <laughs> this caused all kinds of unpleasant health effects. Uh oh, our immune systems had to find weapons to get rid of them. But how do you do that? From the perspective oh, Jesus. of the cell, worms it's like Doom. are city scale kaiju. Oh, okay, on the love that. Worse, all about size skin, comparison and kaiju worms have an elastic protective layer that withstands even stomach acid. Huh. You really need that to I didn't know. Punch to cause damage. <laughs> it takes an I love it when they like make your body like a city We're or a planet. But basically, they do it a the lot. worm enters your body for the first time. Intelligent cells notice oh. their presence. They move to your lymph nodes Sir, and we have a problem. specialized <laughs> antibody factories called B cells. We explain them in detail in this yeah, video. Yeah, I was about to say in the immune system the video. B cells are told I'm that learning they need to things. Parasites and start producing a special class of weapons, IgE antibodies. Oh, tiny those are a new shape. with two pinches that connect to and latch onto and stuff. Magnets to metal. Let's go. IgE floods your entire body and basically go, dudes, begin go. arming a nuclear bomb. An army oh. of really scary cells. That's where the nuclear bomb comes in. Mast cells. <laughs> Mast cells are huge, bloated fellows filled to the brink with histamine and other nasty chemicals. Wow, they yeah. They pick up the IgE floating around and cover themselves Man, with them I didn't know like about any of this. grenades without their safety pins. Uh oh no. And then they just lie and wait, angry. Okay. So Angrily. Now you have millions of <laughs> it's bombs like the in your skin, Mega lungs, or gut. Until the day the mast cells meet a worm trying to uh -huh. enter your body. There's not much time to get rid of it, so things escalate rapidly. 
The mast cells with their IG Hunt spikes Geronimo. grab onto the worm particles and <laughs> oh, let's go, little kind dude. Of explode. They okay. All of their dangerous chemicals all hey, Vegeta. Once. A few things now happen in rapid succession. First, some of the mast <laughs> cell chemicals wound the worms, ripping wounds into them and making Literally them Literally like really kamikaze unhappy. jets or something, but then nuclear. emergency chemicals like histamine cause massive and rapid inflammation, ordering your blood vessels to flood the battlefield with water to oh, flush the snap. worms out. Dude, your they body is so your smart. That make you have no idea what's happening. Overdrive and cover the worms in sticky slime. Oh. Other chemicals are like air sirens, screaming loudly throughout your body <laughs> for anti-parasite soldiers. Eosinophils, first These guys thousands, are getting then it. hundreds of thousands. They have one job the and they do it well. And leave your blood vessels to where the mast they don't, cells I'm are inflammation. Not only do they make the inflammation worse, they set up for your attack run. Extremely toxic like the trench, Star Wars. They vomit at the worm, ripping yeah. open its defensive layers and causing horrible injuries. Oh, but that's Sometimes, important though. This will straight up kill the parasite. Let's go. Lastly, the anti-worm coordination cell arrives. The basophil. It makes sure that the immune system doesn't slow down but keeps attacking okay. the violence. The fight! It keeps the inflammation We're not done yet. and alerts more and more attack cells to the site of battle. My Zooming God! Out, we see that the chemicals from your anti-parasite forces Again, love make the perspective, your smooth dude. muscles contract rapidly, pushing everything that's inside, outside. In okay. your intestines, combined with all the water, the you notice this as on? diarrhea, as hey, your body yeah, tries to is. expel the stressed parasite. <laughs> In your respiratory tract, so diarrhea is very important. Water flood outside, trying to Just don't get dehydrated. Oh my if god! If this happens under your skin, your tissue is red, hot, and itchy as your immune oh, system. Oh, that's where the swelling comes from. Murder. It takes a fierce okay, when you put it that way. Worm, and your anti-parasite forces have the license to act rapidly and with intense license violence. License to kill, James okay, Bond. This is nice and all, but what does <laughs> all this have to do with killing shrimps? So sorry, bro. What is an allergy? Uh huh. Parasitic here we go. Getting down and dirty. Ripped apart by millions okay. of bombs, and as all living things do, they adapted to the deadly attacks. Oh, of course they did, man. Oh. I mean, it's adorable. Of chemicals to manipulate that one is. <laughs> Not the one before. They make it weaker and much less angry, like immune system weed. It's super Which effective. Bad for Jiggly survival both. because you have to fight off all sorts of intruders every day. Yeah. Our ancestors no were basically breaks. unable to prevent regular worm infections. <laughs> So, as the worms adapted to us, our bodies had to adapt to them. To oh, better snap. any weakening worm See, I love you, just kidding. One adaptation might have been to make our immune system more aggressive, so it could still defend against oh, other Oh, but I can see why that's a bad thing. And then a hot second ago, in evolutionary terms, everything okay. changed. We suddenly invented soap and hygiene, but most importantly... Was I correct about being too clean? poop and drinking water. Yeah. This destroyed the life cycles of parasitic worms, and the ones that remained were eradicated by modern medicine. Oh. <laughs> worms still infect up to two Just billion throw it people, at it. mostly in underdeveloped rural regions or slums with unsanitary conditions mm, and dirty yeah. water. The people who escaped these conditions <laughs> now face me. an interesting problem. Yeah, your and body just didn't stop. A major enemy that had kept it down for millions of years. It could very well be that our immune system still operates. Still on patrol. The worms are making it weaker. And that it has to be overly aggressive because of that. Okay. AGE, oh, that makes all cells, the sense now. and eosinophils also have other jobs. Starting to understand in real time. Their existence has now gone away, but they kind of act as if worms are around, oh. only that they now attack other dangerous foes like, shrimp? like shrimps. Hey, this is exactly <laughs> literally what the words out of my mouth. have an allergic reaction to a shrimp. Your immune system picks up shrimp proteins. Well, like, how does your body choose IgE what it doesn't like? Shrimps. The antibodies then are mast cells, turning them into bombs. Yep. So you have millions of bombs in your skin, your lungs, or your gut, with a license to choose violence even when provoked. Oh, that is bit. bizarre, man! Until one day you eat another shrimp, your anti-parasite forces flip on <laughs> like a switch. Only there is no kaiju to attack. This is what oh, you it just attacks when itself you have an or your reaction. body. Extremely powerful weapons now target oh your my God. body. They're Under getting an skin, EpiPen, your something? Your vessels suddenly turn leaky. Fluid streams into your tissue. Your skin swells up and turns okay. red. Okay. Again, in that's itchy where eyes. the swelling comes from. You immediately feel hot and unwell. Yep. In your digestive system, the mast cells can cause oh, nausea, no. cramps, and sharp pain as water Ow. floods into your intestines. I hate and watching people suffer. <laughs> diarrhea and vomiting. Uh, your respiratory tract ends. swells up, making breathing hard. Uh. Way more dangerously. Histamine and other chemicals can cause the smooth muscles in your lungs. I legitimately thought it was just your throat closing in. Case, you get a stuffy but nose. there's a lot in the to do. Case, you're suddenly fighting for your life. Yeah. Mast cells all over your body 
unload their bombs all at once, causing an anaphylactic shock. Can we tell it your to chill? Loses so much water. Because that's where the everything comes in. Drops to dangerous levels. Oh, this that's bad. Is life threatening? Yeah. In combination with the things going on in your lungs, anaphylaxis is a life or death emergency. Oh Often no! With just a small time window to do anything about it. Allergic reactions How small are, we are no joke. No, they're Even not. The deadliest diseases like Ebola need days to kill you, but your immune system can kill you within a few minutes. Minutes? And this is why a shrimp can kill you. <laughs> because on a fundamental level, an ingenious okay. defense system... God, I love the way they put it into perspective, man. Millions of years, ...is fighting imaginary kaijus. Yet we still Without the actual kaijus. Some people produce a lot of IgE antibodies against okay, uh, that was my question before. and others don't. We don't know why some adults develop new allergies Bees later in life, or you. why some allergies I mean, disappear over time. You're important. And we're not sure if Can the worms. worms is the main culprit, only that the cells that evolved to fight them are responsible cool. for the symptoms of allergies. There are Again, I do respect like that they're like, if they don't know, they tell you. Or increased pollution. Maybe it's just a combination of all of them. Probably. But what we clearly see is that that is quite and possible. Their more serious cousin autoimmune diseases have been rising massively Jeez. in the last 100 years. <laughs> Wherever humans moved into more sanitary conditions and got rid of some of the horrible parasites hunting us. Hopefully, we'll figure it out and prevent allergies forever. Because one thing's for sure, we don't want to get worms back. Yeah, that's that fair. Would really be like finding a spider <laughs> and exploding a nuclear bomb. Yeah, spiders are bred, man. I don't know about worms anymore. Gizwell bomb. <laughs> wants as many donors as possible to make informed decisions about right. high impact giving. Dude, that was they so informative. Oh my god. I love it with the like the subjects that I know nothing about. Funding to a few I know very little about opportunities they found. Over 125,000 donors have used GiveWell to donate wow. more than two billion dollars. Billion! Rigorous evidence oh, I love that. that these donations will save over I'm assuming it goes going to the right spot. And improve the There's a lot of shady more. companies out there. You can there. find all of their research and recommendations on their site for free. If you've never used GiveWell, man, I've had donate, that problem all the time. Can have their donation I'm like, is my donation actually going to where they say? The end of the year, or as long as matching funds last. <laughs> you can make tax-deductible donations to their recommended funds or charities, and GiveWell tax doesn't take a cut. To claim your match, oh, that's go very to important. And pick that was my other question. And enter Kurzgesang to check out. Hey. Oh, well, that was positively delightful. Oh, we're not done. It took us 10 months to create this latest edition of our annual passion project. Let me hear it. The fact that we're finally able to share it with you is truly our highlight of this crazy year. Was it the calendar? It's the 2025 oh. Human Era calendar. They're getting and up with the calendar the ads. Calendar we've ever made. It all started yeah, back toot in your January. Horn a bit much. While we released the Very first deserved. video of the year, we were already brainstorming ideas like it was for the yesterday. 2025 calendar. For years, we'd wanted to tell the story. There's of the, the normal great stuff I'm used to talking about the calendar. From Africa to find new homes across the planet. I watch it every time. I love it. Research. We read about curious and unbelievably brave humans who Whoa. ventured out into the unknown, hey. paving the way for future generations. Oh, I love that, like concept art but and stuff, dude. I'm a huge fan with like movies and stuff. Do that behind the scenes on twelve pages. No yeah. Less. Weeks of sketching. Like not a book, mind you, just one sheet fabric. per thing. What was it like for those early pioneers? Every oh, I love that. Explored just like the crude the sketches and stuff. Planet, Huge fan of that. by unfamiliar climates and filled with foreign creatures. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, we released our next videos, and in March, we're finally able to tell you about Starbirds. Love the video that. Game we're working on video game. Interactive. That looks like oxygen then, unincluded. Came to life. Or uh, the Mars one that I played. Crafting epic illustrations worthy of representing 200,000 years of human history. Beautiful. We had to get it right. The adventures. Dude, those are like almost the incredible exact. We don't know what our ancestors set out to find, but when they settled all across the planet, they laid the foundation for human civilization. Oh yeah. Then in May, smoking is awesome became our most successful Again, like it was year. yesterday. Really? It had a huge impact and inspired many of you to quit smoking for good. Oh, let's go. Nothing could make us happier. 100% man. In the studio, huge fan of stopping smoking. Piece of the calendar, the That's calendar. why I vape. As always, we wanted to represent the entirety of the human era by adding 10,000 years to the common era Dude, they system. went hard on this ad. I know I already said that, but... was the final touch, and our calendar was ready to be sent Beautiful. off to the printer. Again, behind on the scenes. On our YouTube <laughs> channel, we continue to ask the big questions like, do you have free will? And 
is AI. Man, I'm watching all of these videos and now they're talking about it again. Then, in September, Something special. They finally held the first I don't know if it's quite nostalgia, but it's beautiful regardless. Ads. We are truly happy with the result. It's not just the vibrant illustrations, the, the illustrations paper, do be vibrant. The shiny cover. It's the fact that it represents such an important part of our shared human history. Oh, yes. And all of it, us, essentially. It holds all the memories of an exciting year at Kurzgesagt. Oh, let's go, we man. It's the best product we've ever made. Everything, nothing but positivity with this. A bit biased, but you burbs seem to love it, too. I love it. It's absolutely the entire freaking this section alone was so biased. But so like I said at the very beginning of this ad, man, well deserved. It's become a yearly tradition and a daily source of inspiration. Someone got all nine? Pokemon. Gotta catch special. them all. Get your piece of our shared human history. I just might, man. Essential part I'm literally on the last out. month as we speak. Oh, we're still not done? Jeez. Oh, Merry Christmas. The Dan Bull video didn't make me get into the holiday spirit. This definitely does. Oh, I love it. I don't even know if they're trying to sell me something. This is just positively delightful. Aw, happy holidays. Oh, that's beautiful. This must be the last video then. Aw. Wah. I missed it. <laughs> All right, so like I said during the video, man, I love it whenever like it has a subject that I know like barely little anything about, it. you know, it's just like, it's so freaking cool having that like the knowledge, just like my brain's like a sponge and these Kurtz to get videos are like the water, you know, it just soaks up as, as much as information as it possibly can. And it's just like, I just love that so freaking much every single time they do it. And they do it like pretty much every single video except the smoking and the weed one and the vape one that's kind of sad now that I think about it but like the other all the other subjects like I knew like very little about and like it's just so cool like I said before man it's just so freaking cool having that like they could just like make you have like little bite-sized pieces to like very much help you understand what exactly they're talking about and like obviously their name in a nutshell you know like it goes hand in hand with that dude it's just like every single time it's something special and like the subjects that they talk about and stuff like that like obviously like the allergies you know Know? like it's it, very 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 common at least for my family you know and like me being allergic to like bee stings and stuff like that I always wondered like why like why does your body react the way it does and like this was a very good example of like how they have the knowledge you know like just feed it to you in like little bite-sized pieces like I said man it's just flawless every single time so I'm gonna stop babbling at this point but man it was it was very beautiful and the freaking illustration man like I almost didn't even comment about that like illustration went so hard in this video obviously being the last video of the year you know they kind of had to end it with a bang you know like the ad like the video itself like everything about it was so good even the sponsor was amazing man like everything about this video i adored so much so i'm gonna stop babbling now so thank everybody so much for watching leave a like down below subscribe ring the bell become a member you get videos a day early and check out the merch with that said i have been master zero y'all guys have been fantastic and i'll see y'all in the next episode later days. <laughs>